Lithium ion batteries are everywhere. They're in your cell phone, your smartwatch, they're in your headphones. All of the technologies that we need to get to this truly electrified economy all rely on what's called critical minerals. I think what a lot of people don't realize is the process for mining and recycling of all of these critical minerals is traditionally very dirty. N-Cycle is creating a much more sustainable way to recycle and mine materials for the energy transition. I grew up in Plattsburgh, New York, right on Lake Champlain. I started to become interested in science at a very young age. The thing I like the most about chemistry is that you're looking at the true building blocks of the entire world. I was really drawn to environmental chemistry in particular because I saw such a big need in the electronics and semiconductor space and the fact that we're generating so much electronics waste and have this critical need for more minerals. So things like cobalt, nickel, manganese. So all of these materials are in things like lithium ion batteries. They're also in things like wind turbines. So the big magnets that power these wind turbines, the magnets that power electric vehicle motors, they're everywhere in terms of the electric economy. And we have to dig all of these out of the ground and there's a very short short supply of these materials, and so we have to figure out where the rest are going to come from if we want to meet our electrification goals over the next 50 years. And Cycles technology combines water filtration with electricity. You can think of it as an electrified Brita filter. So traditionally, a Brita filter has a carbon filter that will filter out all of the metals at one time from your drinking water. We have figured out a way to apply a specific amount of electricity to that carbon filter to selectively remove the materials like cobalt or nickel that we want out of the different waste streams or ore bodies. So when we get these wastes in, say for example, a spent lithium ion battery that's come out of an electric vehicle, we take that electric battery, it is shredded by our partners into a material that's called black mass. We take that black mass, we put it into our electro extraction system. It pulls out the things like cobalt, nickel, manganese. So those solid materials are the metals that we then will ship back to the manufacturing supply chain. So it's a completely new way to refine and recycle materials. So instead of having to use lots of harsh chemicals or very high temperatures and pressures in terms of furnaces, we can pull these materials out with just electricity that can come from 100% renewable energy. So we can reduce the greenhouse gas emissions by 75%, making this a much more sustainable solution for all the materials we need to mine, and it's more cost-effective. If we were to implement Encycle's technology on a global scale, it could have a massive impact in terms of the environmental damage that we inflict on the earth. The goal long-term is to create a much more sustainable circular economy so that we never have to mine more materials ever again. And we can just continue to recycle over and over again. My name is Megan O'Connor. I'm the CEO and co-founder of Encycle. <laughs>